Have you ever wondered why some tattoo colors are easier to fade than others? Today, I'm going to be breaking down one of the biggest factors when it comes to laser tattoo removal, and that's ink color. So let's get into it. But first, let's understand the science behind laser tattoo removal. The laser tattoo removal works by sending concentrated light energy into the ink. The laser targets the ink in the skin and shatters it into tiny little pieces. And then it's your lymphatic system, which is your body's natural cleansing system, which flushes the ink out. But here's the catch. Different colors absorb light differently. The science behind color and laser light. Now, take it back to science class. Let's look at the color spectrum. Black is the easiest color to get rid of because black absorbs all wavelengths of light. On the other hand, colors like reds and blues and greens don't absorb the laser light as efficiently, meaning these colors usually need a few more sessions to fully break down. Common color scenarios. I often get clients who have multiple colored tattoos come to me and say, Jamie, the blacks fading really quickly, but the red's still being stubborn, and that's totally normal. Or people with vibrant, colorful tattoos will see that their colors are fading unevenly, and that's not a problem. It's just because of the way the laser is interacting with the ink color. Here's a quick and easy breakdown. Blacks and darker inks, easiest to remove. Reds and oranges and warmer tones, moderately difficult. Your greens and blues, most stubborn. Does the type of laser matter? Yes, not all laser machines are equal. The older lasers may only target blacks and darker inks, whereas the newer models can actually target a range of colors. At my clinic at Goodbye Tattoos, we use a Q-switch laser. The Q-switch laser has three different wavelengths, which targets a range of colors. I'm gonna get a little bit nerdy here. The 1064 is the best for targeting darker inks. The 532 wavelength is good for reds and oranges and your warmer tones. And the 694 helps with stubborn colors like your blues and greens. We often have to switch between wavelengths depending on what colors you've got in your tattoo. Other things to consider. Ink density and ink saturation is something that we need to think about as well so whilst you might have a black ink tattoo and black ink is the easiest to get rid of if the tattoo has got thick lines and there's a lot of ink there and there's a lot of ink depth it still might be quite challenging to get rid of and it may take a little bit longer tattoo age so older tattoos naturally look more faded than brand new ones and that's because over the years your body's already trying to get rid of that ink so you may find that a 20 year old tattoo may respond a lot quicker than say a six month old tattoo if the tattoo is closer to the heart where you have a higher circulation the body can process the ink a lot quicker quick fire faq round can colored tattoos be fully removed? Yes, in many cases, but may require a few more sessions than black ink tattoos. Will colors fade evenly? Not always. Some colors break down a lot quicker than others. What if you have multiple colors in your tattoo? Well, customize your treatment, often switching between lasers to make sure that we're targeting the ink with the correct wavelength. So if your tattoo is a full color piece, it's totally removable. Just expect a few extra sessions and a little bit of patience. If you have any specific questions about tattoo ink color, then put them in the comment section below or contact us directly and we'll be in touch. And don't forget to subscribe. I've got more videos coming around the tattoo removal process, tattoo removal treatments, tattoo removal tips, and you won't want to miss them. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.